I went to the zoo to watch the monkeys wanking, then I went to watch the crocodiles and I was still wanking. <laughs> I went to a swingers club, Dorman goes, it's £15 to get in, or you can pay £20, that includes a meal. I paid £20, I went in, all the old naked guy comes up to me and goes, hello, my name's Emil. <laughs> I went to buy a Christmas tree. The guy said, you can put it up yourself. I said, no, I was thinking the living room. I mean, <laughs> friend of mine said, if I text another man and put a kiss at the end, is that a bit gay? I said, what are you texting him? He said, a picture of my cock. What's the matter? <laughs> Do what you want in those circumstances. I'm going out with an English teacher, which is a bit awkward, because she keeps on correcting my grammar during sex. I'm like, who's the daddy? Who's the daddy? <laughs> She's no, the daddy's whom? <laughs> I'm like, suck it good, bitch. She's no, it's suck it well. And she gets particularly annoyed at my improper use of the colon. <laughs> oh, I can do more filth. Ah. So, I accidentally filled the escort with diesel. She died. <laughs> All right, fuck it. Last three. I'm just gonna count. Let's see just how fucking horrible we can get. <laughs> Don't like it when you're kissing a girl and you suddenly realise her eyes are open. It's like shit. She's coming round. <laughs> I went to the supermarket and they had a special on. He collects the trolleys. <laughs> 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 Uh, all okay. I was in Ann Summers. I said to the woman on the till, I'd like a thong, please. She said, certainly, sir, stranger than the night. <laughs> I saw a dildo described as nine inches long and realistic. I thought, well, which is it? I always worry when a woman sees me naked for the first time that she's just going to scream and run out of the park. <laughs> I went round Grandad's to walk his dog as I was leaving the house. He said, don't forget poo bags. I was like, all right, Gran. <laughs> That's not quite revolting enough. We can lower the tone more. Um, my girlfriend's ass is like a peach, hairy, and makes a horrible yogurt. <laughs> My girlfriend said she wanted to try some new condoms with something special inside to boost her pleasure. I said, oh, what's that? And she said, other men's cocks. <laughs> I nearly lost my job as a roofer when I was caught masturbating on the first day. Luckily, my boss said I could wipe the slate clean. <laughs> I know, shit, but I'm keeping it. I don't care. Times are hard at the minute for people on disability benefit, aren't they? I've got a friend who's a dwarf and he's struggling to put food on the table. <laughs> Christian friend of mine said that sex between two men was wrong in their eyes. I said, you're quite right, it's supposed to be up the bum. <laughs> you know what it's like when you're wanking off three bus drivers at once and it's taken ages and then suddenly... <laughs> well, the irony of you finishing that one off yourselves, look. You, you have been amazing. I, I, I hate to go, but I, I have to. My time's up. I'm going to leave you with a, a mental image for the, uh, for the special ladies to take away, okay? I was watching a really weird porn film the other day that was just a fat man crying and wanking at the same time, and then I realised I hadn't turned the telly on. <laughs> Save it. Have a great lady. Good night.